Yo, we can like clog up their hand with Pokemon through lure module, and then they might not be able to draw next time with Genesect. I'm just saying like it's a possibility, something that could happen. Let's get it. Unlucky for them. Oh, this is first. Um, okay. Will the war module help them set up? I mean, it depends on the situation. Situational. Situationally, yes. Situationally, no. Situationally, yo. So I probably oh, I have two heavy ball on the list though, so we're chilling. Oh, I need that misfortune sisters though. I need that money. Dude, you're tilting me. You're literally tilting me. Um what this is all just trash. The garbage. Um No misfortune sisters that is so ridiculous um wow cram a magic yeah maybe cramps cramps could be good in here for sure for sure we have like a ton of <laughs> we have a ton of item cards so yeah some cramps could be good definitely not against some crammies is there a way to make genesect worth one prize card or no it's not like a thing, right? Make Genesect worth a, a single prize card. Um, I price two Toxicity, so I need Tox Eel. No, my other heavy balls in the deck, so I don't need to do this yet. So this thing has to recover two toxicity. Oh, you know what? Oh, oh, five. It's beautiful. All right, plus three. Plus one. I think we just yeah, we stack. Oh shit. But this is the worst part. Oh my gosh, no. But our, our deck is just so much trash. We do she doesn't hurt us too much. Right? Like that was like fine. Well, actually that's that's my first Glimwood gone. Okay. Oh, let's get it. More misfortune. Oh, let's go. They got nothing. Okay, this first, because if there is Pokemon. No poke. Oh, a tour? That's trash. All right, I think we just, yeah, risk taker. Cool. They're done. They have 25 cards left. There's no way we don't body them. We should leave the VIP pass in their deck. No, no shot. We're trying to mill them. I'm milling everything. Can I actually choose to leave some of it? No, I'm definitely, I'm definitely just like getting rid of it. Stay Millie out here. All right, all right. They're online. They're online. It's fine.
So I draw three with the first intersect. I need to find this heavy ball, to be honest. My second heavy ball needs to be found. Uh, misfortune. Holy. Oh, another fiver. Let's go. Yo, this is like too hype. Too risky. Ooh. Let's get it. This is hype. <laughs> this deck is so hype. I wish instead, of, oh, I wish I wasn't like flip a coin. Flip a coin is so cringe. Maybe I should have just like been a little bit more aggressive, to be honest. How many energy do I have left? One, two, three. Because this is going to the loss zone now. Oh, but I got, I got two more. Okay. Out on the floor. Two more. So they have four card deck. Okay. Throw this here. Rod, two. I see one more attack with the toxicity. Okay. Actually, a lure module here is sick. A lore module here is like super sick because it like draws. I got tox. What's left? Oh, no lore modules. Unlucky. You see the lore modules actually at the end of the game is probably correct because then there'll be like more Pokemon left in the deck. Risk taker. Oh, let's go. That's a dub. <laughs> What am I, one and one? I, right, this has got to be a free dub. Yo, I'm so hyped for Rotom V-Star, but we're not getting until January. We're not getting Rotom V-Star till January. So dumb, man. Holy moly. I'm, t I'm tilted just talking about it. Oh, I'll also all these two. I think that's fine. Playing fast. We're trying to go fast. We're milling fast. We're playing fast. We need some more. Well, they probably can't attack next turn. But probably. Not guaranteed. Oxel. Let's see. I wish I could like run less toxicity, but I don't know what I. Oh, ho, ho. that kind of just helps them. Well, it's not helping that much. I use all my Genesects, right? I could go get another, but I could go evolve, evolve, quick ball the top deck instead. No, but if they do somehow KO this, I don't think they can attack next turn though. What does the tool do? Uh, if I get KO'd, it mills two cards from the top deck. After that, Stone Shield will be rotated, right? No, we're going to get the January set. That's the February set. We are assuming that uh, rotation happens with our February set. This has got to be a free W, right? It's got to be. There's so many good cards for us to mill on their side, too. What Rotom V-Star does? Yeah, it's the exact same attack. It's just like Rotom V, but more HP, 40 more damage on the attack, and an ability that lets you discard any cards from hand. Um, you discard any number of cards from hand, and you draw that many cards. <clears throat> so, like, the whole... the whole It's going to be the whole same deck. The Rotom deck is going to be exactly the same. All right, we're getting in there. All right, lower module first. Where are their cards at though? What the heck? I draw three. I need Glimwood, bro. Oh, give me that Glimmy. Three. Glimmy. One. That's correct, right? Yeah. All right. 
Oh my gosh. Dude, this shit, I hate this shit. How many items do we mill? We want to mill as few items as possible. All right, two items, three energy. All right, we're chilling. Have they announced what rotation is, uh, what is rotating out? The D block. Is it in Pokemon now? They have like the little letter in the bottom left corner. They just like that the oldest block rotates out on repeat. <clears throat> Yeah, I know. Her name is Primetime Wizard. I know who the I know who the Wiz is. God, this one should be in the bag though. I think we got this one locked up. Another two to the mill. Okay. Yes, little item. We want to mill as few items as possible. Gliz Wiz. <laughs> the Glizzard Wizard. <laughs> All right, I'm just going to set this thing up right now. I should start with this, though. Only two, bro? How am I only getting two on these? It's cringe. I, I think I should actually save this lore module. Yeah, cause they have like a big hand, so if they have a Marnie, then I'm gonna save the lure module. <laughs> Gliz Wiz. I should have probably done that off the first one. Um, okay. I only have two energy left in the deck. Let's go. Dude, it's so nerve wracking every time. I don't even want to see Articuno. I don't even want to see what we're milling. I just want to mill. Uh, yeah, fan club. Um, let me set it up. That's fine. Dude, do I not have anything left? What do I have left? Plus two? Dude. Dude, get the energy for turn. For the twin, though. They haven't replaced my stadium any time, though, which sucks. I should have probably been... Well, actually, did I ever have an Ultra Ball? I should have kept the Ultra Ball or Quick Ball. Oh, I need to get... I need to, like, mill here for sure. I wonder if they have any Marnie left. They've used one Marnie. They probably do. Playing Marnie, they probably play more than one. Um. Hey, we've been needing that. Oh, we actually need that. <laughs> we need them to replace our stadium. Oh, I've been milling all their stadiums. That's why they haven't been playing them. Oh, there's only one milled. Maybe I'm wrong on that. I milled a couple stadiums. So I can just send up my Toxel though, and they can't KO the Toxel because it has a first shovel on it. But if they have, I think if they had Marnie, they would have played it here, right? Anyway. Toxicity. Okay. Oxal. I don't need to use the Toxicity this turn. Draw three. I just want the Misfortune Sisters, to be honest. That's what I really want. Oh. There's nothing to get. <laughs> I pass. One Toxel versus the world. Yo, but do they got back to back boss? No shot. Do they have a third boss? They're down two boss. Do they got another one?
Oh, they got two prize cards, so they would win the game. So I have to go for the mill here. I have to go for the mill here. I can't let them go with the... It's all on this. Here we go. <laughs> One risk taker. Let's go. Another dub. Talks ill. It's fine. I'll use the rotom phone after the first chance sector. Chance sector for three here seems fine. I'll wait again on the rotom phone, I think. Oh my god, chill out, dog. What the heck? All right. I was like, I want to, I want, I was like, I want to cut a toxicity so I can draw into less toxicity. And then I literally draw into triple toxicity on my first turn. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, pass. Shadow Miss after counting Glimwood. I mean, it'll just make it an RNG fest, right? It'll just be if I hit heads, I mill from them. If I hit tails, I mill from me. Repeat. Oh, good top deck. Oh, goodbye, air balloon. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, let's get the squad out there. Chillin', 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 chillin'. Um. If the last Toxel's in the deck or not. Um. I almost wanna like, I don't even know what I'm doing here to be honest. I just wanna draw into two cards that I can Ultra Ball away here safely. All right, that's pretty good. I'm gonna grab this for next turn. Um, I'm not gonna lower module, I don't think. Maybe at the beginning of next turn. Money. Yep. Oh, there was Pokemon in there, but they were Pokemon with the last two cards. Yeah, I guess if they don't take a, a knockout, then I, I mean, I guess, yeah. Well, then I don't care if I have the Toxel in the hand if they're not taking a KO. That's annoying, though. We've got to find a stadium now. Yeah, I kind of want that fourth Rotom phone if I can. Getting a fourth Rotom phone here would be nice. There's like a lot of situations where it'd be nice. <clears throat> Mill two. Need an energy, uh, ordinary rod. Okay. I didn't actually want a guy though. I think if I like, if I don't get a stadium here, I still have to risk it, right? Right? Like, I probably still have to risk it here. Dude, I gotta... Jeez. Toxicity. Let's go. Dude, drawing into these toxicities is so annoying. <laughs> I just don't want them. Back with Cresselia? I don't think it knocks out, right? It doesn't do... 
Oh, it does do 120, yeah. I don't know. Chose not to. Bring back Zincino. No, do not bring back Zincino Mill, bro. That thing was disgusting. Absolutely gross. Um, alright. I loved it. It was a broken deck. <clears throat> My favorite deck ever. I might be one of the worst decks to ever exist in the Pokemon TCG, like for health of the format. What? Oh, that's cringe. Yeah, that might be one of the worst to ever exist. It's better not hit a Pokemon. Damn, I am not attacking this turn. Keep trying to the stupid toxicities, man. I wish I had, there was Pokecom. Pokecom would be good. Um, no more draws left, right? Okay. That deck was literally broken. Frank should have kept that a uh, secret. He would have had an easy. Is Frank the one who? I think everyone just knew about that deck, didn't they? Like immediately. I don't think it was a secret. Be a shame if I could mill six cards a turn and promote a doll in a format with no gust. <laughs> oh yeah, that was the real problem. There was no gust in that format. Because yeah, they were already doing that kind of deck in Japan. They were doing it with like the Mareep though. They really like the Mareep stuff in Japan. Meepin. Alright, we gotta make something happen this turn because we're out of basics after this, I think. No, I have one more ordinary rod left actually. Alright, we're making it happen. Ooh, we're making it happen, all right. Only one? That's so unfortunate. Oh, I need energy. And I really need to hit a heads here. I can handle uh, milling myself. Another five, another five. But can I, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get there. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get enough. I think I'm gonna come up a little bit short here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna come up a little bit short here. Hmm. Two more. If they just have a boss in hand, we just lose, right? We've milled all their boss. We've milled one boss. One energy left. <sighs> Only two. I was hoping because if we got enough there. Maybe, how many energy am I down now? Uh, so I priced two energy. Price one energy. Maybe I should play a seventh energy. I'm down with the seventh energy, to be honest. I'm down with that. Um, okay. I definitely like the ordinary rod adjustment though. That's been pretty sick, but I think I should play plus one energy. But does this matter? Like I still just lose, right? Oh wait, did I have a shovel left I could have got? Oh no, did I have a shovel left in the deck I could have gotten? Ugh. I maybe did have a shovel left I could have put on my active there. Wait, what? Wait, is the last card in their deck a boss? I'm tilted if the last card in the deck is a boss. I, mean, I couldn't win anyways, though. Dude, was it? Was their last card in the deck a boss? <laughs> no way. I don't know. I guess it wouldn't have mattered if my shovel was in the deck or not. Module? Okay. Yeah, a game like has to be difficult for me to enjoy it. If it's not difficult, then I don't really enjoy it. What games did I play in my youth? Uh, Halo 1, Warcraft 3. Um, I 
They play a lot of stadiums, so I kind of want to hold my stadium. Yeah, um, what games did I play when I was younger? Those are some of them. Who grew up on Xbox and didn't have the luxury of NES and Sega Genesis? Nope. More so computer gamer than Xbox, but yeah. I just never played. Uh... Oh, I didn't realize this was the end of my turn. Um, it's fine. Uh, but yeah, I didn't. I didn't, I was more so of a computer gamer than anything. Like uh, Warcraft Three, Halo One, Halo Reach, uh, Quake. Uh, Quake Live. What else did I play on? League of Legends. Uh, at some point, eventually League of Legends. And then I liked a lot of first-person story games. Like, my favorite game of all time, I think, is Bioshock. Um, so those kind of games, Bioshock, Bioshock 2, Bioshock 3. It's not called Bioshock 3, but it's called Bioshock something. I forget what it's called. Uh, and then I always really like horror games, so like Dead Space is one of my favorite games. Dead Space 1. Um... Yeah, I like games to have uh, the visuals of a game isn't enough. If the, if the game isn't challenging, then I'm usually not too interested in it overall. Um, Borderlands. No, I don't really like... I'm not a big fan of, like, RPGs. Like, there needs to be... Like, I like single-player games, but it needs to be story-based. Um, not, uh, not I like, open world. Like, I'm not a huge fan of open world stuff. Like, I don't like being, like... I like games that have like where you're like playing the story but like the story is kind of more narrow like that's why i wasn't a huge fan of uh halo infinite campaign because i don't i don't want to be able to go anywhere and do anything i want to be like on i want to i want to be like kind of forced into the story a little bit more and like have the story be a good story you know what i'm saying so i got like, halo one two and three campaigns are so good like bioshock super good bioshock three super good um dead space um, I don't want it like too open worldy just gets like it's just like too much I just want to like tell me where to go and let me like make a good story and then I play the story I don't know I don't like all like the all the extra stuff that's like in open world games I played a lot of reach I played a lot of reach that was my most played halo by far a lot of reach a lot of reach Luna Tony hello yo chill out why are you talking shit so I don't want to use this energy. Uh, I'm going to hold on to the energy for a little while. Because if I hit an air balloon, I'd rather air balloon and save the energy because I'm already down quite a few energy. I think I can draw one card. Um, got some good open world games. Like uh, I played the bat. I played bat. I played some of the Batman games. I enjoyed those like the first one. Uh, but yeah, when it's like super open world RPG kind of stuff, you can do literally everything you want, anything you want. I don't know. I'm not, as, I don't know. I'm just not as big of a fan of those games. I don't know why. Bro, don't do this to me. Bro. Fuck. Oh, was it? How bad was it? How bad was it? How bad was it? Okay. It wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. Fudge. Almost got wrecked. Like I like some uh some level of like looting, like the looting aspect, but not to the point where it like like not like Skyrim. Like I don't like games like Skyrim because it's just too much going on. I don't want to like I like I don't know. I don't want to really be able to do. I don't care about all these things. <laughs> like, ah uh, shoot, this is bad. I need like a heavy ball here. Okay, this is actually pretty. Okay, these are both. This is actually a really good. That was a really good. Ooh, a fourer. Let's go. Four, let's freaking get it. Inventory management is fun for me. Yeah, see, that's what I'm like. I don't want to have to manage my inventory. I want to build some more like loot and shoot as I go. You get loot, 
you gotta get your loot you know conserving your loot to some extent is uh part of the game something like dead space but like it's not that big of a deal all right if i dude all right no more just give me a couple heads here it's fine we're just gonna get heads on this one bada boom <clears throat> Thanks to that. That was actually like one of my first. I think it might have been my first horror game as well. There actually, Pavo was Dead Space. I can't think about. Oh no, me and my brothers played. Uh, was it those older Penumbra or Amnesia? Those are the first horror games I played. I think. All right, keep going, keep going. Oh, oh, a triple. Uh, one card. Ugh. Come on, don't do this to me. All right, let's get it. Let's get it. First horror game was the three four three guilty spark level on Halo One. I don't know if that's a, a horror game. <clears throat> yeah, they have seven cards. If we actually just get a uh, energy here, we might just win. One, two, five cards left. We win with a risk taker. Am I out of energy? Yep, this is my last energy. So this is it. Um, okay. Oh my gosh, everyone was a, every attack was a reflip this game. Let's go.